This LOS is distinguished between value and price of forward and futures contracts. Fundamental concepts of derivative pricing. The concept of pricing versus valuation. The world of forwards, futures, and swaps use different terminology with respect to price and value. These contracts do not require the outlay of cash at the start the way an option stock or bond does. Forwards, futures, and swaps start off with values of zero. Value at time zero equals zero. Then as the underlying moves, their values become either positive or negative. The forward futures or swap price is a concept that represents the fixed price or rate at which the underlying will be purchased at a later date, the future price at time t. It is not an amount to be paid at the start. Okay, So this fixed price or rate is embedded into the contract while the value will fluctuate as market conditions change. But more importantly, the value and price are not comparable, not at all comparable, with each other. So we're just going to go through an example here and it's going to help clarify the concept of pricing versus the valuation. So let's say you own a stock priced at $102, okay? You have a short forward contract to sell the stock at a price of $100 one year from now. The risk-free rate is 4%, okay? So $100 one year from now has a present value of $100 divided by 1.04. Present value equals future value divided by 1 plus uh, the interest rate. So you would have a present value of $96.15. So therefore, the, con the forward contract must have a value of the forward price minus the spot price, $96.15 minus the $102 of negative 585. So what does that mean? The forward contract with a price of $100 has a value of negative $5.85 to the seller and plus $5.85 to the buyer. Okay? The $100 forward price is not comparable to the $5.85 value of the contract. So now we're talking about the forward price versus the value of the contract. And that's why we said they're not comparable. So again, the forward price is fixed. That, that um, forward price of $100 one year from now, that's not going to change. So the forward price is fixed. Uh, any new forward contract calling for delivery of the same asset at the same time will have a different price. As time goes on, the underlying price is going to change. So um, the, the value of the contract is going to change. Okay. So arbitrage profits can be eliminated with an upfront payment from the long to the short or vice versa that is consistent with the forward price that the parties select, okay? The parties could simply negotiate a, uh, a forward price like the $100 and any resulting market value could be paid from one party to the other. It is customary, however, in the forward market for the initial value to be set to zero. This convention eliminates the necessity of either party making a payment to the other and results in a direct and simple determination of the forward price. So we're just going to finish this LOS with one practice question, but don't worry because the next LOS is explain how the value and price of a forward contract are determined at expiration during the life of the contract and at initiation. So we get into the topics of value and price on forwards in a big way in the next uh, learning outcome statement. This was just meant to be an introduction and show you the difference between the uh, price of the forward at 100 and the value at the uh, $5.85 and how the, the price and value are not uh, necessarily comparable. Okay. So this uh, last practice question to finish the LOS. Which of the following best describes the difference between the price of a forward contract and its value? A, the forward price is fixed at the start and the value starts at zero and then changes. B, the price determines the profit to the buyer and the value determines the profit to the seller. Or C, the forward contract is a benchmark against which the price is compared for the purposes of determining whether a trade is advisable. And the correct answer is A, the forward price is fixed at the start 
whereas the value starts at zero and then changes. Both price and value are relevant in determining the profit for both parties. The forward contract value is not a benchmark for comparison with the price. Okay? And that's the last slide for this LOS. Thank you.